So the theme for this one is humans. Because everyone in here is human. This theme was kind of made late in the game. It's early in this, but it was actually made late in the game. So, War Machine is just Iron Man's buddy Vold. He's not a billionaire, he's just a human. He doesn't have any special powers besides being a human with a suit of armor. A lot like Iron Man. That I have a good, the camera always does what I want it to. But I hope I figured out the camera issue for now, anyways. So, I don't know where you would hide hidden weapons on the war machine armor. Because from what I recall from seeing it anime and comic books, the war machine is just... Decked out in armor of all kinds and shades. Uh, like it's guided missiles. It's a war machine. It's going to have war weapons like missiles. It just makes sense. Votes. Is his name Votes? I think his name's Votes. I guess if it's powered by an arc reactor, and the arc reactor is not, you know, keeping Tony Stark alive, it can produce things like a shield, so it kind of makes sense that War Machine has an energy shield to some extent, I guess. Most people, whether they be mutants, magicians, mutates, Eternals, yada yada yada, don't are very squishy when it comes to bullets. You know what's not squishy when it comes to bullets? A suit of armor. So yeah, him being able to shield makes sense. That is Electra, who is a daredevil villain, supporting character. Yeah, I don't know. She's a ninja, though. Guess not only is she a ninja, she's a very good ninja. She's very good at what she does. Especially with the size. So, Raph's weapon? Raphael? Ninja Turtle? Raphael weapons are the size? And just like Raphael, she uses two. Whoever do this art did a good job. Especially the earring there. Wait. She's come back. How? How? There's no Lazarus pit in Marvel. So how did she come back from the dead? It's a very good question that I don't have the answer for. Doctor Doom, Lord of Latveria, Master of Magnetician. Almost the Sorcerer Supreme. At the end of the day, Doctor Doom. Why? He's just a mortal man named Victor Von Doom. Master of magic. Magic and science. Interesting fact about Doctor Doom that probably most nerds know at this point. He has a piece of the Holy Cross in his armor to help him fight vampires. Yes, Victor Von Doom, Dr. Doom, fights vampires. If you... He, he mastered magic, he mastered science, he has several degrees. 
that Aunt Eleanor has several actual degrees. Yeah, he's a super genius. Doi. Though, if you're not a do, if you're not Doom, you are expendable. Everyone's expendable to Doom. As I mentioned, the Devon Doom has a time machine. I forgot that was actually a card that they use in this. I think it's a platform. I don't think it's a car or a phone booth or anything like that. I think it's just a time platform. I don't think it comes with you. I think it just sends you through time. I could be wrong there. When one of your common enemies is the human torch, of course you're going to develop a way to not be hit by energy. Huh. I wonder if he pulls those beams from the same dimension as Colossus' eye beams. That's a joke. That's oh, Colossus. I Colossus' eye beams. That's a joke. But it's Colossus' eye beams aren't lasers. It's a concussion boss, which is weird as hell. On the last human to round it off is the Mandarin, who is a human. That wields ten magical rings of power. The ten rings of power. The Mandarin. Those rings can do a lot of different things. Like shield himself with using basically the same type of shield that Doctor Doom has. Except for his is... Magic based, probably not technology based. It's always good to disintegrate your opponents. I never see it coming. I never see the disintegration coming. Yeah, he is an arch villain. He is Iron Man's main antagonist. One of Iron Man's main antagonists. Or was at one point. I don't think he is anymore. But at one point. The Mandarin was one of Iron Man's main villains. So yeah, this is my um, humans. Dr. Doom, who's a human. Mandarin, who's a human. Rhodes, aka War Machine, who's a human. Electra is a human. This set of cards was based on the fact that they are all humans.